don't understand the point of educating girls. What happened, Dadi? I'm studying because I have a debate competition next week. Oh, as if sending you to school was not enough. Now we are teaching our girls to talk back as well. Our time was much better than this. Girls were married off early and spent their time cooking and cleaning. We should start searching for a groom for Divya. She is still a child, Ma. I want to ensure that my children study for as long as they want to. If she studies too much, finding a groom will be very difficult. No, Ma. If Divya is educated, she can choose her own profession. She can become a doctor or a teacher or whatever she wants to become, Ma. You know, even presidents and prime ministers of some countries are women these days. Moreover, our society is slowly changing and these days people want their partners to be educated. Hey Divya, I will do it. You please go and study. Please don't take Dadi's comments to your heart. She was not able to complete her education and thinks very traditionally. But remember that she cares about you. Hmm. Ma, you know I feel hurt when Dadi disapproves of me studying and not helping at home. Divya, don't get disheartened. I'm always here to support you. I will do the housework. Thank you, Ma. I promise to make you proud. You know what, Aryan? Sometimes I feel like girls are born to struggle and do only household work. Why are you saying this, Divya? My grandmother doesn't want me to study and wants me to get married. She thinks girls should not have any ambition. Divya, don't get stressed. Come, let's go to our classroom. Divya, even our constitution does not allow girls below 18 to get married. That is what my mother told me as well. She has been encouraging me to participate in the debate competition. You are a bright student and should definitely take part in it. Traditionally, our society has often prevented girls from pursuing higher studies. But you are lucky to have such a supportive mother who encourages you to study. Thanks, Aryan. Divya, hello. How are you feeling today? Thank you for motivating me yesterday. It really helped me and I could practice in peace. I am happy to hear that. All the best for the competition. Thanks, Aryan. The winner of this year's district debate competition is... Divya! Because of good education, Divya is so aware and spoke with such confidence. Divya, we will award you with a three-year scholarship and a laptop. It is important to invest in the education of both boys and girls to provide equal opportunities to them. Thank you for joining us today. Congratulations, Divya. Thank you, Dadi. I am not very educated, but I now realize the importance of education. I am very proud of you. Interpersonal relationships are important for every individual's overall physical and emotional happiness. It is important to observe, listen and ask to understand each other's emotions. These skills enable us to build positive connections with people around us, be it friends, siblings, parents or teachers. When we understand others' feelings and emotions, then we become more sensitive to their needs and it strengthens our relationships.